What's up guys, welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys today on this Friday. I hope that y'all have some great plans for this weekend. I'm probably going to be relaxing. Hopefully posted a bunch of videos for you guys. Uh, we're back on the Town Hall 10. I know this farming base sucks, okay? <laughs> I'm just using it for uh, when I push really hard and uh, what the freak is it called? Boosting, which is what this whole video is about. This whole video is about boosting your army, uh, your barracks, okay? That's what this whole thing is about, how effective, how efficient it is for farming and whatnot. So as you can see, I've got a whole bunch of gold up here. Um, I don't even know if I can upgrade. I don't even think I can upgrade a single thing. Yeah, okay, so I can upgrade. Oh, I can upgrade a Tesla to max. Yes, I would like to do that with my 5 million gold, right? Yes, all right, so here we go. We're gonna go ahead and upgrade one of those Teslas up to max. I don't think we can do, nope, we can't do Wizard Towers. Let's go ahead and upgrade the Teslas. Um, 14 freaking days on that thing. Uh, two weeks, man. Gosh, that's ridiculous. Teslas take so freaking long. <laughs> they take so long. It only takes 10 days, but still. All right, so this whole video is about barching and um, boosting your army camps and working hard. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna sh we're gonna go ahead and, and have an attack first. I'm sorry, I'm out of it. I haven't been on my town hall 10 or I haven't made a video on my town hall 10 in a while. Um, <clears throat> but I'm gonna show you guys. I'm I'm still up in uh, in masters three right now. Just hanging out. I didn't want to get too far away from champs because I do want to try and push back up there for uh, YouTube All Stars as we go up and continue pushing. Um, I think we're like 60, 60th in the world right now. I'm not too sure. We can check on that in a second though. But um, we're gonna go ahead and search, and I'll be back with you guys in just a couple of seconds because I know y'all hate watching me search. Uh, actually, I'm gonna test this base. So here's the base I'm gonna go with. Um, first, you want to make sure to take out uh, some mortars. Does he only have two mortars? Yes, he does. He only has two mortars. Nice. No, he has three. I am completely blind. So <laughs> we're going to take out this mortar right here. And we're going to take out this mortar right here. And we're just going to start spread. We're going to spread out our bars. I'm sure all you know how to barge. We're going to spread out a good line of barbarians with our archers right behind them. You can make the archers a little bit uh, thicker than the why I swear sometimes playing on the iPad is really freaking annoying because you can't get two streams as you just saw the barbarians right there were not going out as I wanted them to um, there's a whole bunch of Teslas over here so we're gonna drop our barbs a little bit heavier down here in this area um, it does not look like he has any clan council troops or anything like that let's get these barbs up here and get some of these archers up here to help us take this out so we're at 39% uh, we are working our way up still 43% and come on archers do something 44% and 45% and come on they're working their way in come on keep on going guys 47% 48% and now what we are going to do is drop down our archer queen use her ability so that she takes no damage and she takes all these guys out in the battle right there 109,000 gold, 121,000 elixir, and 75,000 of each from the bonus. So even if I just got 50,000, it'd be an effective raid, uh, especially with how quickly you your barge trains up. So um, while I would have been away, I just finished doing all this. Uh, I just finished going for a two-hour little stint. That's how I got up to 5 million. Um, and we can go look at the attack log so you can see... Uh, this one is 39 minutes ago. This one's 47 minutes ago, so that's eight minutes apart. This one's only six minutes after that. Hour and two, so that one is seven, eight, nine, and then this one is 11. This one's six minutes, so they're very, very close together. Depends on uh, how long you attack for, if you let the whole time go out. So if you attack for the whole three minutes or if you stop. Uh, and then you come back and you wait for about three minutes, and then you have an army all ready to go after that. Uh, and so this isn't going to be that long of a video. I kind of just wanted to show you guys what I do when it comes to farming up at Town Hall 10. Uh, in the master is probably high crystal areas where this would be the most effective. Um, maybe, maybe even a little bit lower, but a lot of this is based off of the loot bonus. So you can see these top three, four, these top four, uh, you can add 75,000 to each of those. So this next one wasn't too bad. I mean, I didn't get the loot bonus from it, so it didn't really pay itself off. Same with that next one, but again, there's a loot bonus on this one, loot bonus on those bottom two, 
as well. Uh, and we can go ahead and play, uh, let's replay this one as well, and we can just <clears throat> watch it. So the biggest thing in this is finding bases with a lot of buildings on the outside. As many of you know from Barching, that's what you got to do. So I took out that one mortar up at the top, and we're going to spread our barbarians all the way around with our archers just like before. Uh, but this is a very effective, efficient way of farming. If you have two hours to put away, say you're watching a movie or you're watching some TV, a lot of times I will just um, put it away, I'll play it, and then I'll watch every eight minutes, I'll raid real quick while I'm watching the movie, so on and so forth. And it's super easy, super efficient, uh, it doesn't cost that much elixir-wise or anything like that. Y'all can see the video playing over to the side, so we're at 40 percent right now. Um, our archers are doing work up at the top and here comes some more barbarians and archers. 44 percent. If you can get to about 40, 45 percent uh, with archers and barbarians then your heroes are going to very easily clean up for you. Uh, the king doesn't do too well with this strap because of all the buildings on the inside uh, and he has to break through the walls. So uh, this one was actually funny. So I got that double right there. Um, I got that uh, the king's pad and that builder so they were right next to each other and then I got this so I almost lost that one It was very very close. I didn't have my heroes on that one uh, So that one was super super close. I was a little bit worried about it for sure um, <clears throat> But there's another example of how it works You just got to make sure that you have your lightning spells with you uh, Which either you can boost so you can see mine are actually still boosting for another five minutes So I might as well just go ahead and train those up um, and I generally just I fill up two with barbarians. I fill up two with archers. One and uh, why did I just say one? <laughs> so I fill up two with archers, two with barbarians of my barracks, and just let it go. I'm not too particular. A lot of people will do a hundred barbarians and the rest archers. I don't really care that much. That I mean that does work better, but it's not as time efficient because you have to plan everything out. Um, before you leave. I can just fill them up and just go. So uh, the whole point of this video again guys was just to tell you guys uh, that boosting and using barge is a very efficient way of uh, farming. As you saw I had five million gold. Uh, we can go in here and look at the attack log and so it doesn't even go back far enough but you add 75,000 to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of those and it doesn't even go all the way back. So 75,000, I don't even know what the math is on that, but it's probably like 600,000 or so. Uh, and then the loot from all of these, <clears throat> maybe like 500,000, the loot from all these adds up as well to a couple million in two hours. So yeah, it's effective, it's efficient. I was able to upgrade my Tesla from it, so that was freaking sweet. But that's gonna be it for this episode, guys. Uh, I know all of you know how to barch. You lay down a line of barbarians, you lay down a line of archers. Uh, but it's been working really well for me in Champs 3. Um, but for a lot of you guys, you could probably do it in high gold or low crystal. I think that it would definitely work there as well. I'm going to drop down there after YouTube All-Stars and just farm my butt off. And I can't wait. We're going to do a farming series on it for uh, Town Hall 10. I know that a lot of you guys aren't Town Hall 10. Uh, that's something I want y'all to comment down below. Comment down below what Town Hall you are because... A lot of y'all, I'm sure, are uh, 6, 7, and 8. Some of you are 9 and 10. The majority of you are probably in the 7 to 8 town hall range. So definitely comment down, that down below for me just so I can kind of see what my fan base is when it comes to um, when it comes to y'all's town hall level. So yeah, that's going to be it though. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I really do appreciate it. Make sure that y'all head over to my second channel as well, Molt Plays. It's in the sidebar right there. Uh, go check it out. I'm playing a new game, Plunder Pirates, on there. It's freaking sweet. But yeah, thank you so much for watching, guys. I really do appreciate it. And as always, make sure you keep calm and you clash on for me, right? I'll see you guys later. Peace.